Hello and welcome to Wagner Academy. This is question 77 for our SAT math questions. This one says let P equal M plus N over 2 or divided by 2 and Q equal 2MN divided by the quantity M plus N. If P equals Q, which of the following must be true? So if P equals Q, that means this must equal that. So let's write that out first. M plus N divided by 2 is supposed to equal then 2mn divided by m plus n. And I'm going to try, looking down here, I'm going to try to get what m equals in terms of n. I'm going to see if that's even possible. So let's work this out here first by cross multiplying. So we would have m plus n times itself, m plus n squared for this times this, and then we'd have 2 times 2mn would be 4mn. If I foiled this out, I would eventually get m squared plus 2mn plus n squared. That would still equal 4mn. Subtracting t the 4mn from both sides would give me this. I'd have m squared minus 2mn plus n squared equals 0. So right now this doesn't look all that promising, but I could factor this out actually. I could say this is m minus n squared. If I were to refoil that out or remultiply that out, I would have m squared. My inside and outside piece would be negative mn putting them together would give me negative 2mn and then my last piece negative n times negative n would give me positive n squared from there if I took the square root of both sides the square root and square would cancel here I'd have m minus n equals the square root of 0 is still 0 adding n to both sides would tell me that this would have to be true. It would have to be true that m is the same thing or is equal to n. Therefore, looking up at my answer choices here, choice b, that has to be true. These other ones, they could be true, but they don't have to be true necessarily. This is the one, based on the algebraic work we did here, that definitely has to be true. m equals n.